How are you going? Let's put some light on the situation here. Right, I'm taking a couple of young fellas hunting this morning. This is not a hunting video, it's just a quick snap video. I had most of the dogs inside except Bruno because last night was freezing. Bruno's got loads of bedding in his box so he keeps warm, plus he's insensitive to pain. So we'll go and check out the puppies. Oh dear, Po has thrown up her dog roll. She's not well. What's the matter, Po? Mate? What's the matter, mate? You alright? Yeah, it sounded right. And all the humans are going, oh, it's disgusting. But actually, it's very, very natural for dogs to regurgitate their food and eat it again, and that's exactly what she's doing. Yeah, way you tell. I'll eat it, eh? Good morning, Chad. Hey, hello, Chad. There's my boy, eh? Did you have a good sleep? And did uh, Uncle Pace look after you? He gave this fellow his own box. Oh, I'm a big yawn. We had the fire going last night, so you guys should be nice and warm. Or should have been nice and warm. It's gone out now, but uh, probably warmer than I was in here. Yeah. What are we going to do with this fella? Because you're too young to take hunting, but we're going out this morning. Are we going to keep you on the lead? We'll put you in a box by yourself at home. Yeah? What do you reckon, B? Leave the bastard at home. Yeah? What do you reckon, Pace? Yeah. Leave him at home. Take me, take me. Yeah, I know you want to come. Trouble is just too young to run with the other dogs. God, they're cute. <coughs> yeah, mate. Yeah, you try to talk to me, eh? You missing your sister? No? You just couldn't give a bollock. She's over at Arwee's place. Because Arwee's looking after her. Why decide whether I'm going to keep her or not? She doesn't even have a name yet. But you do, don't you, Chad, eh? Oh, yep. Yeah. Looks like the cleaning lady's doing a job. No, oh, Poe. I wonder what made her throw that up. That was last night she's thrown up because it's, uh... Oh, I don't know. She threw it up last night. The rats would have come out and tried to get it and she would have grabbed a rat. Maybe she was baiting rats, eh? Is that what you're doing, Poe? Right, we will let you guys out. Probably shouldn't encourage you to jump up, should I? Because that's not what you're supposed to do with dogs. It's a bad lesson I'm teaching you, but just can't help it. Okay, mate, you can come out. Come on. You're not sure about coming out, are you? Oh, it's a beautiful day. What a cracker of a day. Bloody cold, but this is what we want for hunting. It's going to be a late morning start. We're not going to pick up the boys till about uh, oh, quarter past nine, I think. We're meeting up at Simon's at ten. Old Bruno's going to start making some noise. I love these days. So I skinned those pigs yesterday, or the pig at least. The fat I didn't get off it. Okay, Bruno, I'm coming. This is a little bark. G'day, boy. Here you going, eh? G'day. Did you have a good sleep? I bet you did. Normally he runs loose, but I put him in again last night. This my neighbour's got a dog up here that's been roaming, and I don't want any scraps or anything. The dog's been coming onto this property. So uh, that's what we did. Having said that, it's kind of good putting him in the box at night too because he tends to roam a bit and uh, the other dogs hear him and they wake up. Hey puppy! Hey puppy! G'day mate! How you doing, eh? Jeez, you're a cutie, aren't you, eh? He's a cracker. Right, I'm going to take him for a walk just down the front paddock and then sort my shit out for going for a hunt. I don't know where the hell B's gone to. He's been a bit chasing bloody hares and rabbits again. It is a freezing morning. We need it though, because it's been crazy warm considering it's winter. In fact, so warm in fact, that uh, these mountains over here, I don't know if I can pan it on the phone or not, probably not. But normally, there'd be snow up there, like lots of it. It just isn't. Just little pockets of snow, but not what it should be. That's odd. Bizarre for this time of year. It's the first time I've ever seen it like that. Tells you something about the uh, climate, doesn't it? It's bloody all stuffed up. It's supposed to be uh, heaps of snow up there. Hook come. Good girl. Pace come. Jed come. Good boy, Jed. Good girl, Poe. Good boy, mate. That's the first time you've come. You actually copied Poe, but that's how we learn, eh, off the older dogs. Sit down, Poe. Sit down, Poe. You don't get to jump up. You're too big for that shit. 
Only the cute small wild terriers get to do that shit, don't they? Doesn't make sense really, does it, mate, eh? It's completely uh, unfair for Poe. Yeah, they learn everything off the older dogs. B, where is he? Come on, mate, come on. Good boy. I had a bit of a shift around. We put the old caravan here in the corner. And the pod on top. That's the pod that I made that goes on top of my truck. Which you're sleeping. I may be using that uh, soon because I'm heading down south hopefully in the next uh, few weeks. It's a good thing to sleep in because it's nice and warm. Sure beats sleeping in a bloody tent. Yeah, I know you guys want to be fed, but I'm trying to find B. Because he's buggered off. And I can only think that he's gone to look for... Uh, Rabbits or something around the corner because the place is a war on there. A lot of rabbits are living in. Good morning, Ducky. Morning, Ducky. Yeah, we'll feed you in a minute. Just as I suspected. What are you doing in there, B? Hey? Eh? Trying to catch rabbits, eh, B? What you doing, B? All this tin here's got shelter for lots of rats and rabbits underneath it. Bruno looks like he's going to be sick now. What the hell have you been doing, Bruno? Made you sick. Looking flash. It's coming up, isn't it, boy? Here's the big technicolor yawn. What's happening, boy? Leave him alone. Let him throw up in private. Pace, get out of there. You're going to get a feed. Is it typical dogs? No, this food's coming up. Pace, like, where is it? Is it coming up? Not for you, <laughs> Pace. Get out of there. False alarm, mate, Bruno. Nothing, eh? <laughs> He's trying to probably uh, make himself vomit and then thought, no, that little wank is going to eat it. So I'll go into it somewhere else. I'll pace thought he was going to get a hot breakfast, didn't you, mate? But Bruno kept it back in. Yep. I oh, know. Let's get your brother B in here. Up. Good dog. You're ready to climb up, are you, mate? You haven't got your mate in there either. You ready to have a go at it? Hey? Come on, happy. Up. Up it comes, come on. Up. Not up me. Uh, there. Yeah, there you go. Come on. Give you a bit of a hand. Here we go. Right, you stay there for now. Bruno, come. Got some kidneys, mate. Pick kidneys. You might be feeling a bit crook this morning. You'll be just to go, gone will be gone. You're not very well, are you, mate? Hey? Hey? Not that well, all. Oh. Hey, Ducky, you want some kidneys this morning? Eh? Yeah? Want some kidneys? Got a fat in it. It's a tail wagon? No. Just got a wee bit there, get a little bit of fat. Not much. She's going, nah, the tail's not wagging, she's not that uh, breast. The old chicken's going, yo, tear it. Only a fat there to chew on. Bruno's revisited it again. Ain't happening, is it, Bruno? Here, Ducky, here's your own little pile. Here you go, mate. And these guys. Right there. The old tail's wagging, she's happy. Good dog. Pace, come. Come on, eat up, mate. Just a small breakfast this morning because we are hunting them in a couple of hours, but I like to put food in their belly. You're not even hungry, are you, Pace? <laughs> Typical. His brother's going to eat most of that. Well, not his brother, his uh, nephew at least. B. You've been very patient, mate. Yes, you are. And so is Poe wagging a tail. I don't know if she's going to get a feed because she's already eaten her own vomit this morning. Yeah, after a bit of dog roll, aren't you, mate? Yeah. Okay, mate. There we go, here's your feed. I'm going to take those two out for Poe. Not that she really needs much more. He's got a good appetite, this little fella. Tail's wagging. Happy dog. He's going to be a lovely boy. There you go, mate. It's not much, but it'll keep you going. I'm not going to feed Bruno this morning, his guts is a bit upset. I don't know what he's been eating, but something's uh, not right, so just leave it. She's hanging around, you know what she wants? She wants a bit of that, a bit of dog roll. There you go, mate. 
Yeah, the old tail wagon. She's got it. You know what? She's never taken it out of my hand. Not once. No, that's my finger. She's like saying, drop it. Come on, drop it. There we go. Ah, she got it. Happy duck. Happy duck. These cold winter months. Oh, they gonna... Hey, and first, it's the first. She's never taken it out of my hand. It's, I've had it for, I don't know, 12 years now. That's the first. We're learning something, aren't we, eh? Yeah, that worked. I'll try that again, eh? Oh, you've learned it, eh? You've worked that one out. It's amazing, eh? All these years, and every time I go to give her something, she's never taken it out of my hand, and now she's suddenly onto it. The duck's brain, eh? If only you knew what went on inside. What do you want, mate, eh? You keep on uh, guarding that uh, bit of kidney down there, stop everybody else eating it. But you won't eat it. Dog trackers with rip collars, all charged. Both GPS tracking units, these are the Alpha 100s charged. Trackers in and GoPro. Second GoPro. Cup of tea in the morning, gotta have it mate. This gets the day started right. What's happening big fella, eh? Breakfast is what's happening. Yeah, have an egg shell. Good for your calcium. Mate, not having any. The catch. I oh, dropped it. That's a whopping great pile of sauerkraut, which I'll have every morning. Take your finger away from the camera there, Clay. And it's just got loads of vitamin C. Always missing is some bacon. I actually ran out of time to cook bacon, can you believe that? So we've got some cucumber, some brie cheese on my egg, another big wad of brie cheese there, and a load of sauerkraut. And that is breakfast on the run. With a cup of tea. I'm going to tear into uh, this breakfast. Mmm. Window's still frozen. Everything's bloody frozen. So in here I've got a few bits and pieces. The, uh, 14 line down there and what else is in here got some spare collars one of my radios is missing because yesterday I took the old uh, Pat out young Pat hunting he's taking me radio we have just arrived at my mate's place Simon and in the back we've got young Ben who's 12 years of age who is keen as mustard only a second hunt with me and I've got some chaps for you too, mate. We're going to some steep country, and this fella here who biked 30, no, 24 kilometers. 24 kilometers. To the pickup zone this morning, so he's keen. We're a wee bit early, so uh, anyway, I'm just going to add this little segment to my snap vlog uh, to let you guys know what our Sunday vlog is. Keep an eye out for it on Patreon, it will be out, and hopefully, we get some blood on this guy's knife. Because he has a stuck a pig here, have you? No. No. All right. No, so hopefully something happens. It's pretty steep country, so you've got to get there. Yeah. I know. So this is the end of my snap vlog. I hope you enjoyed it. It went very well today, our hunt. Didn't it, Jody? Yeah. It's going well. <laughs> he's got a massive boar on his back. We don't know what weight it is, but he's done bloody awesome. Hope you enjoyed the uh, vlog. And we'll keep you posted on what's happening just by doing another one tomorrow. It's very easy. It's just all on the telephone. Cell phone, not telephone. Be good. If you can't be good, be careful. See you later.